Hey guys, Boss Engine Twenty Five here with James. Today, James will be doing will be playing trains today. That's, that's the camera, yeah. Yes. Cool. Right. <laughs> Let, I'll 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 get us moving, and then you will see the rest. Right. W mm -hmm. sets the reverser. Yeah. And then A is the throttle. Okay. Early on, you probably I'm just going to open the cylinder pops up. You don't have to worry about that. Basically, you press A that. That's the gas, that speeds you up. But you can see the boiler pressure going down. Yeah. So you have to be very careful to manage that so that thing's breathing usually. And you're still getting stuck. So you have to kind of fiddle around with the reverser and the throttle. Okay. So A A, A, A increases the re regulator, yes. But that decreases boiler pressure. Okay. So yeah, you have to be careful with that. So which one And there's the your speed. Is? Yeah, W is the reverser. That does. I don't know that that also that dictates how much um, that dictates how much uh, steam goes into your cylinders. Okay. So um, you can increase the the reverse gear, but that's. Are there any other important keys? No, the brakes are controlled by clicky, clicky black. Fair enough. And that's your speed limit. You're currently going 40. Also, you might want to uh, pull the throttle back a bit. The regulation. Yeah, so D. Yeah, there you go. So you can. You have to just fiddle. Let's go. So when that goes red, then yeah, then you've got some fiddling. So sometimes, okay. sometimes you let it go red because it got too high and the safeties are popping off. But yeah, fair enough. And does S control anything? That, that's just that's uh, pulling back the. Oh, okay, so it's the work between the two of them. Yeah, I get you. Yeah, that's fine. I wonder if there's a... no, there's no pass here. Well, I basically described this route to James as. Ghibli, but in train simulator. Also, you might want to slow down and get get slowing down, mate. Yeah, you're going slow down. How do you slow down? D. You oh, you D, decrease yeah. the regulator. You, you bring it back a fair bit, I'd say, because you're going. Yeah, you might want to. This route has lots of ups and downs, so you're going to be doing a lot of adjusting. Got it. Slowing down. No, no, you can go up to eighty. Yeah, I know, but fair enough. Right, this is going to take about an hour, apparently. Also, yes, we are running a, we're running a British locomotive with the wheels technically too wide for the gauge. <laughs> but that's because I wanted James to drive a steam train, and he picked this route, and I'm like, yeah, sure, whatever. You're not going to gain speed up that. Oh, okay. That, that that that's just too steep. Fair enough. Oh, I just realised apparently in night at night time there's fireflies. Oh, okay. Should have done this at night. Oh, that's right. Some other time. Some other time. Some other time. It's quite so well this thing's taking me into now. This thing is, is, is a, well then again, it's only got like four things. Four, four, four coaches. Yeah. These things are not that hard. But then again, you've got the thing. Uh, working the fire and boat and making sure there's enough water to the thing. Oh, we're about to pass through a first station. Let's just pop off here and take a look around. Let's find a little Japanese town with the, with the shrine and the pagoda. And the bollocks. There it is. Uh, and then we're, we're curving off. I'm just waiting to go off the rails. Nah, <laughs> No, it needs to be going a fair bit quicker. What happens if you go higher than the speed limit? Nothing. It, like, you have a higher chance of derailing. Oh, you can derail. You yeah. can, in this you can train some more, but I'm not sure. Okay. Presumably you can in that as well, but... Oh, but that has been noted. I promise not to derail. Hello! You see, the reason they closed that, closed the firebox doors, is because if they didn't, the pressure would put push all the burning stuff back into the pack. Yeah. Thank you. A hunt off. Oh. There we go. So what if you're going really fast speed and then flip the brake off? You slow down. I mean, yeah, but like... <laughs> <laughs> That's it! Like, you, but you like a, sud a sudden stop. There is no such thing as a sudden stop in the train chase. 
I, I'm, I'm aware of that, but like, I'm just saying, why would you have to stop that just to send the train flying? Send it? Mate, you, you, you have forgotten that. The brakes might not. Like, the wheels might like you skid, but that's about it. Fair enough. The interesting thing is, the big boy runs on the same gauge as like, the, the UK drop motors. And this tiny thing compared to a big boy. Yeah. You're about to go uphill again, so you might want to start. You might want to get ready to apply more power. Yeah, I will. More power! <laughs> well, so Jim and put our tickets for the... I know, I remember <laughs> the word train, James. I'm not that much of a retard yet. The Rock and Food Festival thing, I was on that last year and we're going on again this year. James hasn't been on a Steam train yet. Never been on a Steam train. Yes. Admittedly, I kind of hope we break down some of the world on this. I think it's rough. Yeah. Yeah, that's the safety spot in that. I mean, the border comes in that too. Oh, yeah. Careful, you're going down your mess. That's fine, you don't have to do Then again, you do want to keep the speed up because of the, uh, all the bumps in the middle. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. You're accelerating further! Whoops. I'm just pulled the... You, you, you can basically run the thing in reverse and that, that will slow it down. Oh, it's that cool. You don't need to make it. You're going uphill now. Give her some more. Okay, so here's the map. And there's Nintendo. Got a fucking Nintendo on everything. Um, we're down... Here. Yeah, oh yeah, this is the more straightforward bit. Next time I say we do the night when we do this. Yeah, yeah. Just look at all the curvy bits. Oh, okay. Hey, good. Yeah, that's all the more mountain pass it is. This is based on um, Hokkaido, which is uh, the northern island of Japan. But you won't be able to apply as much... You might want to slow down there. You're going heavily down here. Going slightly faster. That silent view. Scary features. They said like the fucking Doppler effects of this. You know, like on eBay, like a proper American. Freight train horn, like a K5 LA, which is like yep. a 5 chan thing. Costs like 1,500. Fair enough. It's a hefty thing though, but... Yeah. Attach that to your car. So the thing is, here, since we don't use those types of horns, it will... Oh, by the way, you know, like, as we're recording this, yes. the, pe the people on my channel haven't actually seen the Castle Reeve again. Oh, fair enough. But that's scheduled to go up sometime in August. Fair enough. Genesis. I edited them together, but there was no problem. I'll tell you, what you need to do is go professional on us. Yeah. Use at the point you say. Yeah. And then voice over. Yeah, but I'm just this isn't the best part of the point steps. I know, but you know. A little bit of editing. It's a long something. way. Yeah. Pay for an editor. <laughs> <laughs> you forgot I have very little money games. Yeah. Well, very little, but the last one got saved. So 
Yes, but um, I don't know. This, these are uh, fictional places. The fact that I just said it's, um, the 50, it's exactly an hour to the 50th anniversary, so that should give you an idea of how time it comes to the 30th. By the way, you know that one, like, going to Castle that gave me like a week to make a video? Oh. Yeah. Alright, well. They went like, um, the... Like, um, uh, like, like, monster to, uh, kill their... Kill their... Oh. Which guy's up to this? He wants to try out this test. Quite time, yeah. Depending on like the I mean you can cut it all time for it. Fair enough. The way I have is his own game right there. Oh yeah. What's there? Wait one. I'll get it over the front of the game. The only one could tell us you can't play multiplayer. That's fine. I'm happy enough to walk with the snares. Oh no, you can play it. Oh, nice, thanks. <laughs> I doubt I will. Yeah, let's place it. Neither of us have had a stairs in our life. Right? Well, I've never had a console in my life. Before. I mean, the stairs are pretty much. Definitely before my uh, time, anyway. What is this? What year was that? It's nice. I'm not sure. Oh, See, so we're not even talking about the trick. It, in regards to the train. <laughs> well, that's our confidence, yeah. I'm just gonna check what now, and then what the next stage is going to be for the stop at the station. Well, we'll stop at uh, Matsubayashima. Super Nintendo Entertainment System. That was released in 1990 in Japan and South Korea, 1991 in North America, 1991 in North Asia, and 1992 in South America. In Japan, the system is called Super Planetary. In South Korea, it is known as the Super Combo. Yeah, so just based off the Japan release, I'd say that's still a good. 10 years older than me. Yeah. So yeah, way before my time. What is this? This is the Yankee one, the original one. What is that? The most nervous one. And then the Japanese Super Famicom. And the one that composed the same case as the Yankee one. So that's, that's what that's based on. Yeah. Right, so the panel was discontinued in 2003, North American 99, EO 98, ER. Right, in Brazil in 2003, and then Korea in This is sold 49.1 million units worldwide. Right, best selling words. Game, Super Mario World, 20.6 million. Donkey Kong, 9 million. Super Mario Kart, 2 million. Street Fighter 2, 6.2 million. Yeah, that's pretty good. 
is less to see than the accessories. You don't need to start slowing yet, but you're still too hard, too crowded for that. Oh, okay. <laughs> They've rebound it from like the 737 Max 8 to the 737 by 8,000. Which is up to a bunch of people, although I remember I can hold it. That's just because of it. Do you think I can't kind of understand where it's coming from? Because this way, like, the public will be scared of them, not on flight, and the reputation has been tarnished. Yeah. So even if they repair them, they can make it safe to Then, I say you want to look at the ball again. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah, we're stopping The way I'm saying is, we're stopping there. Yeah, but even this way, you're going to run out of pressure, and it's also not happening to accelerate. Push an idle for the long test. Zero zero and coast in basically. Quite a bit break from here to it, but. Thank you. What is the, is, is the whistle thing anyway? Yeah. So can you control it from the inside and make it. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yes. I'm wondering if you can... You can't change it, Sam. No, no, I know you can't do that. Can you just do it? Uh, okay, okay. So can you just like... Yeah, like do it in the right way so it's gonna make something out of it. Then you can just do that with pressing. Oh, fair enough. Right, I say we should. I'll, I'll start breaking. Yeah.
I mean, it's a tiny platform, so there's no way all the cards are going to fit, but... Uh, and you've only got one passenger that wants to get on, anyway. Yeah. So, yes, that was just James' first attempt at driving a steam train. Yeah. I'm about 1025, and we're going to go play on the SNES. Goodbye.